Why and her kids have been totally kept out of the loop from all the viewers, one second they are here and the next they aren't. Just like Moses, are we also not going to see Connor Newman anymore on the show? Will Judah Mackey be fired and be so beige later, like they always do? Where is Connor right now? All these questions, but don't worry, we have got you covered. So, without any further ado, let's jump right into it. Hey everyone, welcome to Trend Street. Before we get into the main part, let's all wish Judah Mackey, the child actor behind Connor Newman, a happy birthday. Born on December 21st of 2010, Mackey is turning 13 years old. He is finally stepping into his teenage years, you know, the first step to adulthood. Born and raised in Los Angeles, Mackey has a lot of talents. He first got his big break into acting in 2017, when he got to portray the role of young William Lynch on Criminal Minds. Mackey did not just appear on Apple TV's The Morning Show as Teddy Kessler, the son of the news anchor Mitch Kessler, played by Steve Carell, he is also the voice behind Carl in the awesome Peabody award-winning cartoon, Stillwater. Not just that. He even got to play alongside Robert Downey Jr. in season 2 of Perry Mason. And get this, acting is not his only jam. Mackey recently nailed a major achievement by snagging his black belt in Taekwondo. This not so little anymore guy kicked off his Taekwondo journey at the age of 4, and after about 6 years of kicking it, he proudly shared a then and now picture, showcasing his epic growth in the sport. Mackey got his major fame when he joined the young and the restless. He stepped into the role of Connor in August 2019 when Adam Newman's son underwent soap opera rapid aging syndrome. And since then, he has been in and out of the show. He was the star of the show for a quite remarkable time, but we don't even get to see him anymore. Being the son of Adam and Chelsea sure has its ups and downs. And for a while, he did inherit his dad's acting upside. Connor started acting all wild, locking his little brother in the garage, and breaking his own arm doing some crazy jungle gym stunts. Then he pulled the classic move of asking to live with his dad. Chelsea reluctantly agreed, thinking it was a short-term thing, but surprisingly, Connor turned out to be a mini-schemer, trying to get his folks back together. He claimed there's a monster after him. So they brought in Sharon for counseling but he was not having it and wanted her gone. After a hostage situation, he played the nightmare card to reunite his parents. But that happiness was short-lived. Adam went nuts, Chelsea thought about shipping Connor off to boarding school, and she even framed Adam for Ray's murder, which eventually led Chelsea to a mental hospital. Post-mental hospital stint, Connor lived with his grandma, then came back to Genoa City. Then he suddenly lost Ray, found out he has a half-brother Johnny, and worried he caused Chelsea's breakdown. She reassured him, and things seemed better, until recently. Like always, the show has been disregarding the young people of the show and repeating the same story with the older cast. The last time we saw Connor on the show was when he was getting bullied at school. Apparently, the kids at his school were talking about how his mom tried to kill herself and how his dad and granddad always fight. Connor wanted to change schools and looked for other schools outside of GC. So Chelsea, trying to be a good mom, took him away from town. And that was it. Now, we can't help but wonder if that is the last time we will ever see Connor. Maybe the show will send him away to some other school like they did with all the other kids. And when he returns, he will be so aged again into a high school graduate. If that happens again, we will not be seeing Mackie anymore. But there is still hope that soon all the kids will return to GC and have a major storyline for all of them. It really would be a great freshness if we started getting some new drama on the show involving the kids. What do you guys think? Let us know in the comments below, and don't forget to wish Judah Mackie a happy birthday too. Thank you for checking this video out. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for new videos every day. Turn that bell notification on if you want to hear from us and comment down below if you've subscribed and we'll make sure to reply and thank as many of you as we possibly can.